This is news from Family Council. Earlier this month, law enforcement in Illinois reportedly found the remains of more than 2,000 aborted babies at the home of abortionist Dr. Ulrich Klopfer. Klopfer, who passed away earlier this month, lived in Illinois but operated abortion facilities in neighboring Indiana. Life News reports now four Indiana lawmakers are seeking an investigation to determine what happened and whether the aborted babies were illegally transported across state lines from Klopfer's Indiana-based abortion facility to his Illinois home. State Representative Ron Bacon and three fellow Republican lawmakers issued a statement saying the Indiana Attorney General's office should investigate the abortion clinics in Allen, Lake, and St. Joseph counties, where Dr. Klopfer worked. The Attorney General's office hasn't responded to a request for comment. The story is reminiscent of Philadelphia abortionist Dr. Kermit Gosnell, who was convicted in 2013 of murdering babies born alive following botched abortion procedures. Prior to Gosnell's arrest and conviction, law enforcement found the remains of some 45 aborted babies stored at Gosnell's surgical abortion facility. Stories like these are reasons why Family Council has pushed for stronger regulations and oversight when it comes to abortion. Laws may not seem like much, but ultimately they help prevent unborn children from being sold to labs for scientific research or thrown away like medical waste. Family Council, promoting, protecting, and strengthening traditional family values in Arkansas. Visit us online at familycouncil.org.